Hi, my name is Danielle Budden. I'm 27, and last week I quit my job. Most people in society would be upset, anxious, or angry about that. But with a current $36 in my bank account and a very small income, I feel the richest I've felt in a long time. I chose to always put myself and my soul first in all decisions I make in life. That includes work environments. Too often, the average person is forced into an environment that turns them bitter, cold-hearted, and void of life, especially in America. The definition of life can be different for a lot of people. It can mean adventures to new places with new people. It can mean having babies and a warm-cooked meal on the table. It can mean love from a significant other on a lonely night. What it means to me, you ask? I'm still creating that idea. I do know that I don't want to allow just anyone to use me, take me for granted, or walk all over me for money or status, or recognition. The only recognition I need is from my own heart and the feeling in my soul when I give it life in all forms of the word. My vision is not for anyone else to understand because it is mine alone, just as your vision is yours and for you alone. The one thing, though, I must say is for us all to walk alone in our visions, we must walk together first. Love is lacking everywhere, and as someone who loves so deeply, it hurts to go through a world that praises you for tearing each other down. A world where a boss can make you hate waking up in the morning, but then make you love them for giving you monetary gain at the end of the week. This is not a world I aspire to live in. This does not mean I'm ungrateful for life. It's quite the opposite. It just means my idea of life is very different from the world we live in today. With that thought, do you think we all can be happy in today's world? Or is it set up in such a way to distract us from what life can actually be for you? I'm not really sure where my direction in life is going. I have a couple goals and plans because those are always important. But I know one thing's for sure. I will only ever do the right thing for my soul and the souls of my loved ones around me. I will only do things that aid the greater good and create love and balance in the world around me. No amount of money, status, or greed is worth my soul and happiness I have within me. I hope we can all follow our souls and listen to how our environments make us feel. Don't ever be afraid to do what's best for you. Leaving a negative situation you think you need will only open up doors for an even better situation in the future. I love you all very, very dearly. And think with your souls.